My name is Lina Ho and I'm an assistant professor at Duke and U.S. Medical School and also a joint um, junior principal investigator at the Institute of Medical Biology at ASTAR. The purpose of uh, our lab's research is to discover novel targets to treat and reverse cardiovascular metabolic disorders. I'm Nicolas Plachta. I'm a developmental biologist. The key question we want to understand is where do we come from? How do we develop from a one-cell embryo? And we focus on those very, very early stages of embryonic life. I, I received a, an email from somebody that uh, I've admired for a long time uh, for her research out of the blue one day and she decided to pay a visit to us, our lab in Singapore. Um, and when I asked her, how did you find out about me? Um, she found out about me from the HHMI website. So being part of the HHMI network opens up a lot of new interactions or possibilities to interact with a great network of scientists, all HHMI members. Over the years, I've had the opportunity to mentor students for a year before they go off on their PhD, teaching them how to do things in the lab and also how to plan for their career, what is the, what is the strategy that they should take. It's been very fulfilling because every person uh, is different and I wish that somebody had told me some of the things that I you know, had given them advice about. Uh, before I joined Lina's lab, we already established very early on that I was keen on pursuing a career in research. So one thing that she's really helped me with is making sure that I meet all of the criteria and, and actually take the steps and action to uh, apply for my PhD. And you know, she has not spent any effort in guiding me as though uh, I would be a future PhD student. In my lab, we are about 10 people. We kind of move as a, as a whole team, pushing together in more, most of the times in the same direction. Beyond lab work, Nicholas really provided me with a sense of um, what a science career is like. Beyond talking about the details of our research, we also talk about what I would do after my PhD and the different career options that I have. This is a, a very typical question. Everyone wants to know what's next? Where are the greatest discoveries? Where is the research going to go? We don't know. We never know what the answer to that question is. We know that as long as we keep doing what we're doing, we'll run into new discoveries. Science is a career that demands your best. It's not a job, it's a life. And it's a really exciting life because you get to have the freedom to pursue and ask the questions that intrigue you.